Hi. here at the Drama League Awards on Inside New York. And I'm Audra, and that's Will. Happy anniversary! Happy anniversary. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome to Inside New York. It is the theater award season, and we're kicking it off with the Drama League Awards. We're going to be talking with a number of the Tony nominated and certainly those that have received a nomination this year. I'm one of the, the many actors from Broadway and Off-Broadway that are nominated today and I'm, I'm nominated for the play I'm doing, The Little Foxes. Oh, how wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you. For those people who haven't seen it yet, can you tell us a little bit about it? Sure. It's a play from uh, 1939 that's written by Lillian Hellman, but it takes place in the South in 1900. And um, it's about kind of the evils of capitalism, racism, and misogyny and how they intersect in some pretty brutal ways nowadays, but even more so perhaps in 1900. So, but tell us also about why you're involved in theater. We all know of you as, as a great uh, TV and film actor, but why theater for you? Um, I just love theater. I love, I love acting in plays. I love uh, being a, an audience member. I just think that there is nothing like a live experience of theater. And, you know, movies are great, TV is great, but in, in theater the playwright is really the king or the queen, as the, the case of uh, Lillian Hellman wrote this play. And, um, you know, to get to sit in a, in a seat and see great actors do these tremendous classical works or new works, it's, it's great. Well, you know, you're both veterans of theater. Uh, what would you like to say about this season? Uh, it's a terrific one for new work. A lot of a lot of new things um, that that uh, that's always inspiring to see things, even things that aren't based on a movie or or a previously told story. So it's nice to see brand new stuff springing up. Yeah, I think it's definitely going to be a spread the wealth kind of year, for sure. Uh, do you have any favorites? Unfortunately, I'm in a show, so I haven't been able to see hardly anything. Okay, but, don't uh, be coy. <laughs> so you, this is your moment to, to to spread the word for those who may not know. Of. Of shows? Oh, the, what show you're Oh, what show I'm in? Oh, I'm in Waitress right now. Okay. Um, but that was a show from last season, so um, I don't know. I hear the whole season this year is really great. We want to see so many yeah, things. Yeah, there's so much we want to see, but like I said, yeah, with the baby, I, I haven't had a chance to get out much, but... And I'll Audra, what are you doing? Um, getting ready to go to London to do Lady Day. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, well, well you know, weeks, yeah, that's the last while. time I saw you yeah, was when it was on Broadway, yeah. and yeah. I don't know if it's going to circle back, but... No, um, no, 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 no. No, <laughs> that's going to be too wow. much. Yeah. Well, listen, any advice you have for aspiring actors and actresses to hopefully attain your success? Mm. Sure, just uh, go to the theater, work hard, and audition for lots of stuff. And be to the secret of your success? Um, be true to who you are. Be true to who you are as an artist. That's most important. You can be inspired by other people, but don't try and imitate them. Be yourself. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome, everyone, to the 83rd Annual Drama League Awards. Will and I are so thrilled to be here among so many members of the theater community, and we would like to thank the Drama League for bringing the best of Broadway and Off-Broadway together this afternoon and for giving us the opportunity to share this special event with you.